Alrighty, so we are leaving Queensland heading to the NT. It's going to take a few days to get there, so we might not get there on this little video, but we're going to drive parts of this event away. So if we have a look here, this is kind of the route where we're taking. Um, we're going to take the Golf Developmental Road down back through the Atherton Tablelands. There's an Archer Rest Area Free Camp here. Andara, lava tubes are looking forward to and then all the way across we might stop in Croydon or Normanton, pop up to Kurumba and then down this way towards Cloncurry and Mount Isa. In here there's a place called Corella Dam which looks really good and then off into the NT. Cool, that uh, should only take a couple of days but we'll get into it. See you soon. I need to start And being busy way too often And working late too much Drawing my lines just to cross them Letting myself down, setting myself up I need to do what's right by me There's places I want to explore With how my hair rolls in In terms of the tours themselves um, There are two main tours available so you've got the archway tour um, and I think it's called the tunnel explorer we did the archway tour um, because they actually don't allow kids under five on the tunnel explorer um, the archway tour is all flat um, either flat path or boardwalked so it's a little bit easier terrain so we were a bit disappointed at first that we wouldn't have the opportunity to do what looked like the more exciting tour but um, to be honest the archway tour was amazing um, the tour guide was fantastic thank you Wes so knowledgeable um, they obviously tell you the history of the area and it's just there's just um, so many fascinating things around here the landscape is just amazing so they talk about these areas of um, semi-evergreen vine thickets which is pretty much just a pocket of rainforest a random pocket of rainforest um, in the middle of the otherwise arid savannah plains um, and the reason that this kind of landscape can sur survive is because um, of the collapsed volcanic lava tube so they're sustained by the um, mineral rich soils of the lava tubes um, and they're just beautiful like you'll find fig trees in there um, bottle trees um, like I said in in the middle of the desert essentially yeah the lava tubes them themselves are just amazing it's just like this cave-like tunnel um, formation made by the lava as it's just um, melted its way through the landscape um, so yeah absolutely fascinating area um definitely worth a visit um and we couldn't do both tours but if you can i'd highly re recommend doing as many as you can because we we're a bit bummed that um i didn't plan a bit better maybe uh, cam and i could have done separate tours and take it in turns taking it in turns looking after the girls but um anyway yeah massive thumbs up to andara um, and there's a pool here too because um, it's quite hot so thumbs up he's not gonna hurt you look how beautiful he is yeah, he's all right yes Searching for freedom, slowing down time. There's more that I feel deep in my bones, hidden in me. There's reasons I know I've been searching for freedom, searching for my. So we're 
part way between Cloncurry and Mount Isa um, and we've stumbled upon this place called Clem Walton Park. It's supposed to be one of the nicest campsites, some say in Australia, but um, or free campsites in Australia. Um, so we'll see how it goes. The gate uh, looks locked, it's apparently not. So let's hope not, otherwise we're not camping here. So Nat was struggling with the lock just a little bit. But, um, it is quite a complex little locking system here. The locks are all locked, but you just unravel the camp. <laughs> Genius. <laughs> This Delilah's going fishing. I didn't catch a fish this time. What are you doing, Delilah? I'm going fishing. Can you show me how you fish? I'm going to fish. Yeah. Go on. Yeah. Show, show me how you fish. Do you think you'll catch one? I caught one. You got one. Well done. Should we go cooking? Yeah. All right. Got a pink barra. What do you got, Delilah? A pink barra. Show me. Come closer. I can't see it. Did you go fishing again? And what did you catch? A pink barra fish. A pink barra. Well, that sounds yummy. You must have and, been. And do you want to put um? Spicy sauce on this yum fish. I think I should. And milk and a milk fish. A milk fish too. Alright, we can do that. You mm. might have been attracted to your shorts and your pink chair. Maybe that's why you caught a pink barrel? Yep. Yeah. What am I gonna do with it? <laughs> 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 Well, talk about an awesome spot for an overnight camp. Um, waterfront, plenty of flat ground, so you don't even have to unhitch. Uh, if you're ever heading west from Normanton to Mount Isa, definitely stop in here. Um, beautiful sunset, awesome sunrise, plenty of fish, turtles, bird life. Um, yeah, just a really picturesque place. Um, so plenty of boat in here too actually heaps of people look like they camped up here for maybe a week or two um heaps of little tinnies running around but um for us we're heading off uh today's actually our last day in queensland so later today we'll be crossing the border heading into nt so heading into clam walton park uh, you can camp at corella dam um corella dam was actually constructed for the water supply of the township at Mary Kathleen, uh, which is actually a old extinct town now. Um, there's, there's nothing there, um, but it was home to, I think, just over a thousand people um, at one point in time. But it was because they were mining uranium. Um, so you can either camp here or you can camp just up the road. Um, but we decided to stay here because it's a bit cooler. Um, but um, yeah, Mary Kathleen old town apparently there's still ruins there you can see where all the slabs for the houses were um, and from the campsite there you can drive 7k's up and check out the old uranium mine um, apparently it's still radioactive so they suggest that you don't jump in the water um, but very blue looks awesome um, but yeah we decided to camp here but uh, yeah cool place
church coming The winds were swinging around I feel the wind beckoning To come along now. 